Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I have a special recipe for you guys for Yamista. If you don't know what that is, it means stuffed in Greek. And we're stuffing tomatoes, zucchini, bell peppers, and even eggplant mm -hmm. with a delicious ground beef mixture. Mm -hmm. This is a special recipe from my Yaya Olga. This is my Papu John, and this is my dad Nick. Hi everybody. So stay tuned and I'll show you how it's done. <laughs> So for these stuffed vegetables, I have here bell peppers, tomatoes, zucchini, and eggplants. You can use one kind or a mixture of all of these. And what I'm doing is I'm hollowing out the insides of the vegetable with a paring knife or a spoon to get as much of that pulp out as possible. Now if you guys are new to my channel, I post three videos every single week. My recipes are always quick and easy, straight to the point and always have a unique twist to them. So be sure to subscribe so you won't miss out. For the filling, I have here zucchini that I'm chopping up into small little squares. As you can see, this is a very healthy meal. It's pretty much vegetables stuffed with more vegetables. A bunch of green onions is going in, along with half of an onion. You can either use white or yellow or even red. And then two cloves of garlic is going to be chopped up finely and added in as well. One and a half cups of short grain rice is going in. Be sure to use short grain for an incredible texture. Now this part is optional. I added a lean ground beef, about one pound, and then goes in all that oregano, the salt, and the pepper. And then a good yamisa must have a fair amount of olive oil. So drizzle that in. And for my last two ingredients, I have fresh parsley and fresh mint that I'm chopping up. This is about a half of a bunch and I'm gonna mix this up very well. Stuff all of this delicious mixture into your vegetables and top them off with their lids. Now don't forget that the recipes are always listed in the description box below. Before we pop these into the oven, I'm gonna add a few potatoes, season them well with salt and pepper if you like, and for the last part, I'm adding another drizzle of olive oil on top to keep them moist while they're baking. And we're gonna be adding a cup of water just so that these don't burn on the bottom while they're baking. This is going to go into a 350 degrees oven for two hours. This is what they look like when they're done. Check them halfway. You might need to cover it with foil or add some more water to the pan if it's burning. The rice should be nice and tender inside. These yamista are just so amazing. Just one bite is gonna make you feel like you're in the Greek islands. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe down below and stay tuned for more quick and easy recipes. Okay, you got it. <laughs> Hi everybody. Today we're making Hi, a really yeah. special This is my papu John. Sorry, son. What? It's yummy, it's yummy style. Also, it's uh, you put eggplant too. Uh, my wife. <laughs> my wife. <Here>. Papa, <laughs> what's the matter what with you? you? <laughs> it's your granddaughter. <laughs> Papa. Papa, me me last. Don't talk, okay? Here's the Look, okay. Part, Look at Sava, Look at Sava, he's making a second hand. Recipe for, <laughs> for stuff.